Welcome to TrackBill. I'm Tom from the marketing team and in this video we're going to learn how to use the advanced search feature from TrackBill. In previous videos we learned the basics of search by using the search bar and the orange magnifying glass button. We've also covered Boolean search language and how it can help you save time by searching multiple terms at once with AND and OR and searching for phrases or groups of words by using quotation marks. With advanced search, we can combine multiple search terms as well as exclude certain terms to give us the best results. We can then save all of those filters to run that same search again in the future. So let's get started. From the dashboard, we'll navigate up here to the drop-down box under Search, and then select Advanced Search. Now, step one is to choose the words or phrases that will be included in our search. First, we choose whether we want to include all or any. We would choose all if we wanted to really narrow down to as specific results as possible. We use any when we want to make sure we'll catch legislation that is relevant to our issue, but is in an area that uses different terms to describe the same thing. Here's what I mean. Suppose you're in an organization that is very focused on legislation around the use of red light cameras and speed cameras. From your experience, you know that there are multiple terms that are used, particularly from state to state. So, you would click any and then start adding the terms. Type traffic control device, then we'll click add, and then red light camera. We can click add or we can just hit the return key on our keyboard. Speed camera, red light ticket, red light violation, and speeding. Okay, so that's a pretty thorough list of all the different references we generally see in legislation around this issue. Next is step two, where we can exclude certain phrases from our search. Generally, you'll find you exclude far fewer terms than you include, but for example purposes, let's type in ambulance and fire truck. Step three is to select how wide you want to search, from just one state all the way up to all 50 states, D.C. and U.S. Congress. Your default is just the states that you are already tracking. You can add individual states from this drop-down box, or you can click Nationwide to select all 50 states plus D.C. and Congress. Let's choose Nationwide. Now that we set up all of our filters, we'll just click the orange search button here in the middle and see what we get. Okay, so we see 207 bills match our search criteria. Now we can either start skimming through all of these bills, or we can click Edit and revise our search if we like. So let's pretend we expected to see more than 207, and we think maybe we should not have excluded fire truck and ambulance. So let's click Edit and remove those excluded terms. All we have to do is highlight them and click Delete on our keyboard. Okay, now let's click the orange search button again. 223 results. That's more like it. Before we start scrolling to determine which bills to track, let's save this search to save ourselves time the next time. We just click the orange Save button here. Now, TrackBill creates a default name for the search. Here it says, Six Phrases in All States, D.C. and Congress. But you can rename it to anything you want. So I would call this search Red Light Camera All. So that's how you run an advanced search. By saving the search, you can regularly check back and rerun it. So if you get into a routine, like checking for new bills once a week, you can also save time by using this drop-down box under Filters and Introduction Date, and then choose Past Week. And remember, if you ever get stuck or have a question, just click on the Start Instant Chat button at the lower right of your screen, and one of us will either help you right away or you'll be prompted to leave a message and we'll help you just as soon as possible. Thanks for using TrackBill.